that's my ex-boyfriend in the dashboard, just in case you're all wondering. Oh, I was gonna go, but I just decided not to. Yeah, put his ass in there for talking shit, so. <laughs> that's where you go. So that was pretty bad to the bone. Saw a bunch of young fellers that were also getting out of the river. I saw a bunch of them coming out and I could tell they just got out of the river. I was like, do you guys just get in? And one of the, guy go, one of the guys goes, I did. I was like, well, it's 47 degrees. Feels good, doesn't it? <laughs> I'm still wet. Like you can clearly see I'm just in my swimsuit. Oh, 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 oh. I don't want to rambone anybody as I like to say. No, but look at this beautiful day. Woo! Just got done doing almost 30 minutes in the river. I saw one of my buddies out here running. He, well, I say I saw him. He saw me. He did a shout out to me while I was in the river. Shout out to you, Isaac. Good job training for Bloomsday, bruh. Good for you. And uh, I didn't want to say anything, but those people uh, that were on the beach, they were out there with their pit bull, and he, they forgot that he was out there, and he was just like, excuse me, let me roll up that window probably pretty loud isn't it sorry about that <sighs> my buddy is all running with his dog and there's the people down there not watching their dog and it was a pit bull and he's all my buddy's running with his dog and he probably doesn't want to get attacked by a pit bull so oh there he is I see him I gotta wave to him he can't hear me or see me he's got his um, head button phones in <laughs> Hopefully he saw me waving to him. Bye, Isaac. Good job. You're doing it. You're killing it. But oh, I wish I had known, man. I got to tell him I didn't want to come out here running with him. <sighs> Woo! Feels good. What a beautiful day. I feel so freaking refreshed and recharged right now. And uh, pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> I was totally laughing because that guy that was coming out of the river as I was there on his um, in his kayak or whatever the hell he had. It wasn't really a kayak. It was some type of flotation device. His girlfriend or lady had a kayak or whatever. But anyways, he was, he had like this full on gear <laughs> and I'm just like walking up to the parking lot, still in my swimming suit. Ooh, look at me. I'm still in my swimsuit. I did not put my robe on. Yes, you guys, this is what it's come to. Let the good times roll, baby. Oh yeah. I just feel so I just feel so freaking good right now, you guys. Like, I don't have, I have goosebumps because I'm still cold. Let's actually turn on that here now that I think about it. <laughs> but uh, what a glorious, beautiful day. It's, it's almost five o'clock. <laughs> it's 4.57 to be exact. We have places to be. And so we need to hurry. And, um, but what an exciting time. Oh my gosh, I am just really excited and looking forward to the summer. But then I'm also really sad though too because like I really don't want, um, I really don't want my cold dipping to come to an end because the water it all it probably like warms up to like maybe 65 or something it's still it's still really cold but not enough to be considered cold dipping so that's what's not fun about that oh my gosh look at that look at that rain <laughs> the way the sun is hitting in the light it's like I'm I got the ram on my chest sometimes I can be um it can be a ram sometimes to fight with me I'm like a ram so <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I mean, Ram doesn't even have to um, sponsor this video. I'm just representing for them. I do love this truck and it is good quality. So Ram, shout out to you and your good quality trucks that you make. Yeah, yeah. That guy's off-roading. I wonder where he's going. Oh, he's just pulling over right on. Right on, bruh. And you're in your truck. I don't know what kind of truck he had, but uh, Okay, now the cold is just hitting me. Now I wish that I had my robe on because now I'm freaking cold. <laughs> freaking cold. Ooh, now I'm shaking, shaking and shivering. Oh dear. Oh dear. Those kids picked a sure hell of a spot to sell some lemonade. I don't know if they're going to get a lot of traffic right there. Ooh. And honestly, like, I'm just... You know, lemonade's not really, it's like a hit or a miss for me. Like, I like it. I love strawberry lemonade. Throw some strawberry puree in there and some strawberry chunks and you, 
now we're talking. But otherwise, no thank you. Oh my gosh, you guys, yes. Feel super, super duper charged about this day. Yay! I did over four miles, 100 squats, and I uh, did my cold dipping for like 30 minutes. And the heater just kicked on. I mean, does this day get any better? I mean, throw some Jimmy John's in the mix and it's like, damn, girl. <laughs> I couldn't help myself. I do love me some Jimmy John's too. The Italian nightclub. Ooh, that's my Sammy right there. Ooh, girl, I'll get you some Italian nightclub in the house. <laughs> Clearly, I've had too much cold river to the brain. Too much cold river to the brain. Make a girl go insane. We don't want to turn there like we did last time. <clears throat> I got to go further on down the road. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Is this where we want to turn? Oh, bloody hell. I think that's where we want to turn. No, I don't think it is, actually. It's not. It's not. Okay, we're doing right. We're doing right. There's a little detour action going on because of all that construction back there. So... Man, the people who can live down here are lucky. They're close to the river. Maybe they don't consider themselves lucky, but I would be loving it. And I don't mean McDonald's. Uh, this is beautiful. River's Edge Apartments. Lucky them. For rent. Oh, man, I bet it's not cheap to live there, though. Well, not that anywhere is cheap to live these days, but you know, I imagine the closer to the river, it's, it's not like you would really go down there and swim in this area, but maybe you could, I don't know. I'm just really glad that right now that that sun is hitting me. And, um, where's the damn heater? <laughs> where's the damn heater? Let's turn this, oh, it says it's on 80. Can we get it to be 100? Can we get 100 up in here? Can we get a hundred? Where the hell do we turn? I don't know. Man, I would live in those apartments. Those sure are nice. I could just walk right in front there and go cold dip, although. Oh. I just don't usually go this way, so I'm just admiring the beautiful view. <laughs> The construction has taken us a different route. But we don't care because that heater is finally kicked in high. And that's all that we care about. Is it needs to be blasting me. Blasting me. I do have this um, electric heated blanket that I got. And I've not used. So that would be really nice right now to just have myself covered in a heated blanket. That would be super duper. It's gonna probably take us a little longer to get home since I have no idea where the hell we are. <laughs> we went the long way again. <laughs> like the long way. We took the long way home. Where the hell did we go? I mean, this is sort of looking familiar, I think. Andy, oh, I know exactly where we are. Oh, see, I tried to trick myself. I had to trick myself like I didn't know where I was going when in fact, oh, I did know where I'm going, do I? <laughs> where the hell? I feel like I want to turn right here, but then I also feel like if I keep going straight that I will be happy with that choice. Let's keep our fingers crossed that's the case because otherwise we're taking the long way home. Oh, sorry about that. It says I have a low battery. Oh, I'm just really loving that that heat has kicked on us right now. <laughs> oh, yes. This it worked out perfectly, actually, because this is right down the road from my house. Damn, I need to remember that shit. That's the way I need to go, bro. Oh, my gosh. What the hell is this street called? What the hell is this street called? I need to pay attention to this shit. You know, I don't like to do that. But this one time, we're going to make the exception and pay attention. Oh my gosh, that was so convenient and close. And this is just the way I need to go to get to um to where I need to go. That really worked out in our favor. Wee! What in the hell is that street called? Well, hopefully we won't forget. Hopefully we won't forget that. Woo! I can't believe that worked out so beautifully. <laughs> I'm 
super excited about that. Man, that sure is super cool, and hopefully I can remember how to, can you see me because it's so bright? Hopefully I can remember that way next time. Nicole Elio! Nicole Elio out! Maybe that's how we should end things. Oh, look at that. A little book, a little book sale. I love books. I do love to read too. Why are we stopping? Why are we stopping? Where, oh, there's police. That could be the reason why. But um, I do love to read, yes. I love to read comic books. Gra oh dear, I need to get over. Uh, comic books or graphic novels, adult graphic novels, whichever you prefer. What are you cool kids calling it these days? Um, a comic book, the last comic book that I read was The Walking Dead. I don't think I finished the entire series. I think I still have some like, some trade paperbacks I can read on that. So that was a good read though. Loved it, loved it. I also loved um, Preacher. Read that one too. Great stuff. Love me some, uh, I was going to say somebody else that's not writing those. And then I, I was thinking Daredevil almost said Brian Michael Bendis. Oh, 11, 11. I don't know if that was early Daredevil, Brian Michael Bendis, but I do love his work. So he's another one that's throw him on the map. He's a good one. Uh, Neil Gaiman, obviously Sandman. I love me some Sandman. Anything Neil Gaiman does mostly, I'm pretty into it. It's pretty disturbing stuff and I like it. I just really love that heat right now, man. It's like, hi, how high can it get? High on life, high. That's how high it is, and I'm loving it. Hopefully, I'm not in trouble when I get home because I'm late, so. I don't like being in trouble, and I don't like being late, so. Two of the things I don't like. Wee! And we're home, kids, and we're home. We're almost home. We're on the way home. We're up the hill home. Yay, 12 minutes. I think that was quick, you guys. Usually it takes me like 15 no idea which way we were going so it's almost the same amount of time maybe but um that was less congested so i'm definitely i thought that was police behind me i was like oh god we didn't make it home quite yet kids <laughs> please somebody call my mother somebody bail me out can you afford me i don't think so but if you all collectively come together you might be able to <laughs> lost my damn mind you guys I'm sorry I apologize please accept my apologies it's official my brain has left the building see what cold dipping does to me it puts me in a in a very good mood I almost said a foul mood but clearly I'm not in a foul mood <laughs> I'm the complete opposite I am in a very very good mood my feet are still defrosting I need to hurry up and change over I'm just gonna wear a dress with a jean jacket. That will look cute and it will look summery. So I should be quick is my points for all that. Quickish. I don't even wanna get out of the truck actually. It feels so damn good. Ah! <laughs> so we're home, we're home, we're home, we're home, we're home. Thanks for driving home with me. Less than 15 minutes, 13 minutes, heck yeah. I'm gonna have to hurry up and end this because I need to rush back into the house and get ready without taking the bush out. So, just always like to add that little factor into it because now that my bush is blooming, it's getting big. My actual bush. There's an actual bush over there. I'll show you one of these times maybe. All right, thank you for driving home with me. Thanks for watching my uploads. Thank you for hitting like and subscribe and commenting and all the good stuff means the world to a girl like me, little old me over here. So, to the next adventure. Peace out, yo. Love you, bye. Mwah! Love you, bye.